Jank Odo moment. Yeah. Gayu, I can't even pronounce the, I can't speak Articuno or Zapdos or Moltres, you know, cause I probably mispronounced that word or whatever, that cry. But yeah, let's take Articuno on. Yeah. Articuno has a weird sprite in this game, but that's okay. Articuno is level 50, awesome. Okay, so let's just go for the Thunder Wave, which is right here, actually, cool. The Thunder Wave hits, awesome, nice. So maybe it'll be full of powers on its first turn. Nope, of course not, let's get Ice Beam. Of course, Ice Beam is like the one attack you have to worry about, really. Ice Beam, wow, 1 HP. Jeez. Jeez. I don't know if I don't want to heal, I mean, I was just going to probably use Thunderbolt, but still. Yeah. Pack, it's going to use Pack to Faint Storm, of course. Storm kind of went down hard, okay. I'm sorry, Pikachu, I'm sorry, Storm. Okay, so I'm gonna go to Tabasco, cause I know Tabasco probably resists Ice Beam. <laughs> yeah. So let's go to Tabasco. This is take one, by the way. Okay, so let's go for this Ember, I guess. Let's see what an Ember does. It's gonna be super effective. I don't wanna go out Flamethrower, cause that'd be kinda stupid, but yeah. And since it's already paralyzed, it can't get burned, so that's good. Because burn and po- Don't try to burn or poison this Pokemon on purpose because it'd be bad. Wait, it's neutr- Oh, it's super effective because Tabasco's flying type. Shoot. Jeez. Okay, this Articuno is already being a pain in the butt. Oh, well, okay. So Lavender's ground, half ground type. Brute's half grass type. Brute, okay. Uh, Gamma or Grumpy? Uh, let's go for Gamma, I guess. Jeez, I forgot that. Like, it's so little about like, oh, if it's half type, if it's just half a Pokemon type, it has a weakness to like, for example, you know, Charizard's fire flying, so it's ha it's half weak to um, it's sh it's super effective actually. It's a uh, ice types are basically ice type moves like ice beam or so they are super effective, even because it's half flying type. But it's not even neutral because in later games it's neutral because you know Charizard's fire and flying. But in this game they take it so little in being so picky with half even the half types. You know, if if your Pokemon is weak to move, even if it's even be, if it's super effective, uh, if I don't I'm not explaining like since. Charizard was, you know, half flying type. Ice Beam was super effective. Because Ice is super effective against flying type Pokemon. Ah, uh, that's just a big pain in the butt. Let's use Ice Beam on itself. It's probably gonna be super effective. Jeez. Nope, it's gonna, yeah, it's super effective. Okay, cool. It's four powers. Like, cool. Let's, we got in the red though. We got in the red. So let's start chucking Ultra Balls at it. We're not gonna use the Master Ball on it though. And sometimes it missed the Pokemon. Yeah, like that one. In, in, in Red Bull and Yellow, they, sometimes your Pokeball can miss the Pokemon, which kinda sucks. It missed the Pokemon, yeah. This sucks. At least in Fire and Leaf Green, it had a chance, like, every single time to shake once. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, but there's a better, I think there's a fast, I think that you can catch these Pokemon faster though, if you have a Sass condition like I do, and if it's in the red health. So hopefully one of these will actually, Hit it, and then maybe it'll go on two, three, and we catch it. That'd be nice. Four powers, look okay, good. Just another Ultra Ball. Nope, it missed the Pokemon. Of course it did. He's pecking on us. Okay, that's not the worst, the least of our worries. Okay, that's the least of our worries, I should say. So I'm gonna heal up actually. So let's see here. Let's use the Hyper Potion on Gamera. Nice. Let's give Ice Beam on us, okay. It's not so bad, right? Yeah, okay, it's not very effective. Good. I like how it's not very effective. Let's go for the Ultra Ball. Nope, it missed the Pokemon, of course. I bet one of these will be really close to catching it, though. Ice Beam Critical, jeez. Come on, I should have healed there, actually. Nope, it missed the Pokemon. Let's give Ice Beam again. Okay, fine, we'll use another Hyper Potion. Yeah, there we go, nice. Four power is good. No, no, the Hyper Potion, sorry. I meant to use a Ultra Ball. Oh, there we go, nice. Missed the Pokemon. <sighs> this is very frustrating, you know, but oh well, it's part of the game, I guess. You know how this works. Uh, at least I hope you do, if you play the older Pokemon games. Mr. Pokemon, yep. 
There we go, we caught it, nice. So we used it. Yeah, see, like, when it actually catches the Pokemon, it's actually a good chance of catching it, like, right there. Perfect example. Alright, our kernel was caught. Yay, we caught on the first take. Awesome. Yeah, new Pokemon, when new Pokemon, new Pokedex data will be added for Articuno. Yeah, Articuno is a freeze Pokemon. It's, it's, it's five feet seven inches tall. I'm, I'm, my, I, my height is five feet seven inches tall if I'm wearing shoes. If I'm not wearing shoes, if I'm just wearing socks or barefoot, I'm five foot six and a half. <laughs> Articuno is, a uh, number 100. 44 in the Pokedex. It weighs 122 pounds. A legendary bird Pokemon. It it freezes water that it uh, contain that is contained in the winter air and makes it snow. Makes it snow. That's cool. I'll give Nectar Articuno. Um, let's name this Articuno. Uh, this is a really bad nickname, but I'm gonna name it Freezer. And I'm probably gonna misspell it too, but well, Freezer. Freezer, there we go, nice. Freezer was transferred to Bill's PC. Cool. Let's use an escape rope. Yes, we're actually gonna use an escape rope. Let's <laughs> uh, use an escape rope. We have like five of them, right? Yeah, we have, we have six of them. Wow, okay. Use an escape rope. Nice, we're gonna spin our way out of here. Too bad Pikachu fainted there. Oh, wait, we, all, we go back to the Pokemon Center. That's actually very convenient. <laughs> it's funny. Let's heal up our Pokemon. Do, 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 Nice. We have to see again. Cool, thanks. Okay. Is there any items I want to deposit just off the top of my head? I want to buy some more. Do I want to buy... Wait, hold on. Ultra Balls. We have 13 left. Okay, that should be good enough for Zapdos too. If not even Moltres, if we get very lucky with that. I'm going to buy like three more Hyper Potions off screen. Um, yeah, or maybe I'll do it on screen actually, because this is actually a short part so far. Okay, so this builds PC. Um, let's check it out. Um, I think I have to deposit a Pokemon though, because there's no move Pokemon we can see it without having to deposit Pokemon. So let's deposit, um, I guess Gamera, I guess. Oh, wait, hold on, withdraw Pokemon, and then we can, we can actually just tell it's by its uh, stats. Yeah, there we go, nice. So here's Freezer. I don't know why it's not full healed if it went to the PC, but well, it's attack. Okay, so Freezer is level 50 right now. It has 159 HP right now. It's uh, Ice and Flying type. Um, it's attack, it's number 44 in the Pokedex, like I said before. Um, it's attack is 101, it's defense is 105, it's speed is 96, and it's special is 144. 141, my bad. Misread that for a second. And all we know is Peck and Ice Beam. Jeez, it's level 50 though. How does it not know 4 moves? <laughs> That's odd. I thought it knew at least 3 or 4 moves. I guess this is Gen 1, so it's different. I guess it's going off that one Pokemon uh, book that uh, said that it knows Peck and Ice Beam as like when it comes back. So I think I'm going to foreshadow here and say that, uh, you know, I think that, uh, I think... Zapdos might only know Thundershock and Peck as well, maybe Thundershock and Drill Peck, I don't know. But hopefully I can find that book I was talking about, like, I'd, I'd, I'd recognize the cover if I saw it, but it was basically, a, uh, it gave you trainer tips and stuff on certain Pokemon, and it showed all the Pokemon. It showed, f uh, Pokemon from Bulbasaur all the way to Mew, which was pretty cool, it had a poster too. <laughs> So I hope they can find that book and put like a little ping image, PNG image of it on screen right now or something like that. Maybe it's been on screen. I hope they can find it. If not, I'll put a text over say I couldn't find it. <laughs> but yeah, it's a, like, it's a known technique. It's actually said uh, that it uh, knew Peck and Ice Beam. So maybe it's going off of that. Because it's Gen 1. I don't know. I could be wrong. Yeah. So yeah, let's go, um, which are all, uh, uh, Gamera. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, yeah, Gamera was taken out. Cool, got Gamera, nice. And just to make sure I don't have any items I want to put on the PC, I'm just gonna check again. Okay, I don't, cool. And then Gamera's at the bottom, good. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, I'm gonna buy some 